think the array of motions has sort of come fluttering back in you know, from the journey we went on. You know, when I first moved from the Lions to the Bulls and everyone telling me you know, you're gonna be making the biggest mistake of your then very short rugby career. The Bulls only play a, a 10 man brand of rugby. You're never gonna touch the ball, you're never gonna score tries. And then you look back at that and how influential that journey was of Heineken Mayer sitting me down and telling me, listen, he wants me to be a part of something special. He wants me to be a part of a journey in what he believes is going to be the culmination of becoming the first Super Rugby coach and being a part of the first Super Rugby side from a South African perspective to go on and win Super Rugby. Well, gets past one, gets to another. This could be it. This is it. Havana has scored. And the Bulls pulled this out of the fire. Around this park. To hear King's Park go as silent as it did, <laughs> scoring that try was um, something unique. And like I said, I think the Bulls supporters that were in that stadium that day, like most in South Africa, probably didn't believe what had just happened. Brian Abana, blistering pace. He has scored the try that has quite possibly won the Vodacom Super 14 for the Bulls. Derek Ocott. Well, it, no, 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 this will is that a deliberate play to put him off his kick, and it's over, it's over, it's 20 points to 19 to the Bulls, the game, the game is over. I sort of started walking towards um, the Sharks bench where John, Percy, but all the guys were. I think it was the most difficult thing having been the teammate, having been their mates at national level to now. Go shake their hands, and, you know, given how distraught they were, given how disappointed and saddened they were at that particular moment. To now, in a way, not exude excitement or elation at what we just achieved, but being able to embrace them and you know, share words of condolences with them for what had unfortunately happened with that. And you know, then, post that, go celebrate with my teammates. Victoria must be going absolutely berserk. Pretty vivid memories and, and memories that you know, I'm sort of grateful that I was able to share with some true legends of the game and what it meant for rugby in South Africa was, was pretty special.